hanging out with maybe the only guy in the pit area that I could say I was on the racetrack in a race car at the same time he was. Nate Peckham joins me right now. One of two cars that he will race this year. This is a hobby stock. He also has an asphalt Camaro that looks pretty darn close to this one right here, as a matter of fact. Been about four years since he started racing. He started racing in the late 90s. Remember the old Enduros they used to have at Weed Sport with the V8s. Nate, I haven't talked to you in forever. How have you been? Not too bad. How's the car? Uh, not too bad. It's something I put together this winter. Mm -hmm. Seems to run pretty good. Had to shake some bugs out of it the last couple of weeks. But... So you've been at Outlaw the past couple of weeks? Yeah, okay. went to Outlaw for opener. Missed the hot last, missed the heat race. Got to run the feature, first time on the track. Okay. Had a couple of work issues with it. Ran it last night, worked a lot better. Okay, where'd you, where'd you finish last night? Uh, fifth. So that was a good run then? Yeah, not too bad. Well, what did we have to work on? What was wrong? Uh, I got to get off the corner more. Doesn't need more traction off the corner. How do we do that? What's that? How do we get more traction coming off the corner? Oh, I'm not and tell sure. Tell me whatever you're comfortable with. Maybe saying. a little more set up, you know, a little tighten up the car a little more, a little more grip, a okay. more weight in the back. Do you have weight you can move around? Yeah, I got weight, really? yeah. Okay, so do we put a little weight on that? Yeah, I got about 300 pounds I can move around in it, so. Okay, all right. What are your plans? When are we going to see you this year? Well, plan running here every Saturday night. I'm going to miss a couple shows, unfortunately, because I'm going to run uh -huh. New York Super Stocks. A couple of run on a Saturday night, they coincide here, so. I'm gonna do that too. And what is that series called? The Asphalt uh, Series? New York Super Stocks. Okay, I've seen some of their races before. Those are some great looking cars. Yeah, they're a good group. They come from all over the state, some from Pennsylvania. Uh, yeah, most from New York, every from Buffalo, or other side of Syracuse, Albany. To so everywhere except from Binghamton, New York. Out, from Watertown, all over the place. We get a group of 25 to 30 guys every time we run. Where are you racing this year with that? I think we got three at Lancaster. One or two at Evans Mills, two at Oswego, uh, one at Perry, which is uh, yeah, Wyoming County Wisconsin Speedway. Now or something now? Uh, Wyoming or? County. Oh, is that what it's called now? Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. You're showing your age by calling it Perry because that was a long time. Well, the old guys know it was Perry. I never Yeah, because it, it was Perry. dirt. Yeah, it was dirt. Yeah, years well, back asphalt to the 90s. To dirt, back to asphalt. Oh, but, is that how it worked out? Okay. That place is really rough. I mean, that asshole's probably back when I was still underneath the dirt back then, so okay. it's pretty rough. And so what's bumpy. our goal for today here at Atlanta Legends? What's that? What's our goal for today? What do we want to accomplish? Uh, the car runs pretty good. I want to check the gearing. Uh, got some new stuff I'm trying on the car. I've never tried on the street side. It's been a long time since I've been running them, so mm -hmm. some of the new ideas that people come up with, I'm going to try a little bit of that, see if it could work a little better. Okay. Plus, I haven't run street tires like this in years. Oh, that's right. Back when I ran, it was always, you know, racing tires. Back yeah. to the old street tires here. Yeah, because so. that's what the old Enduros were, yeah. DOT tires, right? Back in the Enduros were street tires, yeah. Yeah. Then they morphed into street stocks, which were the Diamondback tire recaps. Then we went to the American Racers, which the guys are running now, still days. But, okay. Do you I, run the same DOTs on Friday night? Yep, same tires. Oh, okay. Same exact tires I got on it, yeah. Okay. How do you think this hobby stock division is going to work? Because I've been saying for years that we needed something that was the sportsman is not an entry level class. I don't care what anybody says. Could this be the next big entry level class? Do you think? It could be. I've had my sportsman quite a few years. I still have it. I haven't sold it. Oh, okay. I just stole a couple of parts off to put in this car. Just when the new rules with the motor and the shocks are getting pricey, and uh -huh. and I just didn't have, want to spend the money on it anymore. And I still wanted to race. And some of the guys are getting back into hobby stocks. They used to race like back when I ran. But, oh, know, okay. So some they of those had kids growing up. They kind of got out because their kids are growing up. So they had other things. Kids are now growing up. Now they're getting to digging the cars back out of the weeds again. Yeah. So it says once you get a car and park the sportsman. So I bought one this fall and messed with it all winter, and here it is. There you go. <laughs> Mostly made up of used parts I had laying around. And yeah, because you can't just run an old sportsman like you could 25 years ago, can you? No. Nah. Not now, right? It's... Not not competitively in the top 15. Yeah. Especially here. Spend... Most of these guys top 20 cars. Anybody can win a top 20 here. Yeah. It's just. They're, yeah, they got fifty thousand dollar race car. Yeah, they're all fast guys here, so don't that's true. So, here. well, I hope you have fun. Good to see you again. And uh, Nate doesn't do a lot of these things, so uh, this was comfortable for you. So, no problem. Yeah. Next time you win, I'll make sure I get you. And we'll I do hope another so. One, it's right? been a while since I pulled a win off. Hopefully, again, it won't be so. long. <laughs> yeah. Good to see you. Hit the blue guys. That'll subscribe you. We're doing lots of stuff here at Canandaigua, and we'll be doing two shows next weekend. Good job, man. I'll see you soon, Nate. Thank Thanks. you.